Welcome back to Legendary Encounters Firefly. We're playing Bushrock Shindig Safe, which is basically the second game of the campaign, which is a five game total. There's three, well, there's the three episodes per uh, game, if we want to call it that. All right, up first, we're going to have Jane. We're filling up the verse. This is not good. Not good at all. So add a card, of course, uh, to the verse. Yikes. All right, we're looking for that little crafty survivor who dinged river last time. That was not very pleasant. Uh, so this time, Jane has a talent. So that's actually good, because we may need it to take out the survivor. He's got two, three, four, five attack, two recruit. With two recruit, there's nothing he can do. Let's see if River's got a coordinate for him. I don't believe that she does. She's got all basic cards. Jane is kind of on his own. All right, let's hope he can reveal the survivor. Uh, he's got two, three, four, five. Oh boy, so it's gonna be one of these four and we don't really know what it is. Let's go for a two, just, uh, so we have five. So we're gonna spend two to scan this. Please be the survivor, it is not. It is what? <laughs> Did we just get a ship strike out of nowhere? Oh boy, this is brutal. What do we have here, a booby trap. Oh, ship strike. Ongoing, when we repair the strike, reveal the top card of your deck. Or the top two cards if you're Kaylee or Wash. If you reveal at least one printed star, you disarmed it. Otherwise, it blows up. What? <laughs> it blows up, draw two ship strikes. Oh, goody. All right, so we have found the booby trap. So we basically need to spend five recruit. Um, and then we reveal a card... Oh, wow, I'm just going to read this again. <laughs> so, yikes. If you reveal at least one print of the star, you disarm it. Oh, boy. Um, and we're going to be doing that one at a time. So we're going to try to do it. So when, when does it blow up? Uh, if you, uh, so otherwise, oh, hang on. So this is, oh, boy. So if you reveal at least one print of the star, you disarm it. Otherwise, it blows up. Huh. Okay, so it just, uh, Wow. It may blow up. So we found it. That's good. <laughs> I don't think so. So we have three. We have three attack left with a possible three more to add here. So it would give us a total of six. So we're going to reveal this one because if this is the survivor, we will be able to take him out. Please be the survivor. It's not. It's another one of these alliance rotten soldiers. We have. Um, we basically only have one attack left, so I am going to have to burn Jane's talent, which really is not good to give us three extra attack. So that's going to give us a total of four attack. Two will take out the soldier, which I suppose is good. But one of these two is that rotten survivor. We have two attack left. Can't do anything with it. Can't scan anymore. Can't use um, uh, Jane's talent to scan anyway. And we only have two recruit, which we can't recruit anything. So that was not a very exciting turn for Jane. Oh boy. All right, well, we're going to discard his cards. We're going to drop six new ones. One, two, three, four, five, six, and yes, this game is pretty nasty. Let's see what he's got for his next turn. Um, he's going to have two, three attack, and it's talent, two, three recruit. Oh boy. All right, over we go to River. Okay, so either this one or this one uh, is the survivor, and we're going to add another card in here to the verse. Oh, goodness. All right, let's see what River's got. He, she had a completely basic hand. She's got four recruit, two attack. And I don't think Jane has any. Jane has no coordinates at all. So that's not good. So even the bomb to disarm it, we got to try to disarm the booby trap. We need five recruit, and uh, River's got four. So River can scan this, but you know what? I'm not going to. For the simple reason that if it is the survivor, she's going to take a strike and it just gets shuffled back in again. So I'm not going to bother. She does have four recruit though, and she's going to recruit this one. This is a good one for her to have because she can spend her talent card to just activate this, which is repair a ship strike. Because if we blow up the booby trap, we're going to get two ship strikes. This might be pretty important. Plus it's a two attack. And that's going to be River's turn. That was quick. Wow. All right, and we're going to replace this card with a book. Uh, or Nara card. Wow, three, activate. Uh, book is a main character. He is. Um, choose any two players to each draw a card. 
Ooh, I like that. A six recruit, though. Okay, that's the end of River's turn. Yikes. She's going to drop six new cards. She only has two. So she has her talent and a misbehave. I'm going to shuffle off screen and we're going to grab the rest of her uh, cards for her next hand. All right, I have drawn up her hand. So she's got three recruit. She's got two, three attack her talent. Four recruit, not even enough. Oh, goodness. This is, <laughs> this is brutal. All right. Oh, she didn't have a coordinate either, I don't think. She has no coordinates for Jane. All right. Up next, Jane. Oh man, this is this is not good. It's definitely not good. We now have a full verse, completely jammed. What does Jane have? I thought Jane had a talent. Jane has his talent, so that's good. We know it's one of these two cards. Ah, uh, so he gets to draw another card. <laughs> he draws his flaw. No. Of course, when you draw your flaw or you have it in your hand, you have to immediately do it. And what Jane's flaw is, is he um, he has loyalty for sale. So uh, each other player draws a strike. So that flaw has just given River another strike, a two. So River now has three damage. She's down to six health. And you can see we're going sideways in the verse pretty quickly here. All right. Oh, man, that was, that was not good. So Jane could get a possible two three and three more six attack we have to guess we have to guess properly here so let's uh, uh let's go ahead and guess this one for two it's the survivor yes all right so he's going to gain a strike for that uh so he gets a strike uh draw a ship strike oh man okay this is absolutely painful so we need <laughs> for this strike we need to draw a ship strike so Jane now has two, three, four damage, 11 total health. He's down to seven health. And we have to draw a ship strike. Oh, let's hope this is not too brutal. Uh, what? <laughs> oh, no. Add two episode cards to the verse. A blown engine. <laughs> well, the survivor's coming down. So is this one. We're going to look at that here in a second. And then all of these two... Oh, that was horrible. So we got a bomb on board, and our engine just blew up. One of our engines blew up on the ship. And we got our end of uh, <laughs> end of the scenario card just showed up. Oh, goodness. This is, uh, this is not good. All right, let's take a look at this card. Uh, it's a side job. Okay, you may heal the patient as though it were a main character with one damage to complete the side job. Success, one credit, gain a talent. Failure, gain a flaw. Uh, okay, I'm going to have to read up on how to do that. However, Jane does have one attack left. He's going to cash in his talent card, giving him three more attacks for four. Guess what, Mr. Survivor? You're out of here. We've finally taken him out. Um, at the end of the turn, da -da -da, what do you get for doing him? So, anyway, he's taken... Jane took him out. Well, Jane would probably take him out, of course. Now let's take a look at that. So with him, Jane taking him out, defeat the survivor, you get two credits and a talent. So Jane gets a talent, uh, and we're going to end up getting two credits. So I've got to remember that for the end of the episode. So Jane gets a talent for taking him out, and we get two credits. So we can at least get rid of one of these nasty things. Well, we can get rid of this one. Yikes. All right, and that's going to be, I think... Is that the end of Jane's turn? He has three recruit as well. Did I use his recruit at all? I don't think I used his recruit. Did I? No, I didn't. I think we're going to go ahead and we're going to get a uh, brown coat for Jane for three. Uh, so there we go. That's going to be the end of Jane's turn. Man, we're going to have a card coming down for River. This is bad news. All right. End of Jane's turn. Six new cards. One, two, three. He's got four. Hmm. He's got the heal, but... I don't know, I'm going to have to shuffle off screen, and we're going to drop two more cards for Jane's hand. That's going to be his hand for the next episode. And we're going to finish off today with River. All right, so Jane's hand now looks like this for next episode. Pretty basic stuff. He's got two, three, four attack, three recruit, and he can activate this ability to heal one of River's strikes and give himself one. This is getting rough. All right, that goes away. Up. Last is going to be River. We've got to add a card to the verse. This one's coming down. What is it? Oh my goodness, another crazy looking card. Enemy Alliance 4. Ongoing, River and Simon can't fight, 
Commander Heart. River can't fight him? <laughs> no! Oh. I don't believe this card gives you a strike. This is just a side job. And I can't remember if side jobs get into the... It doesn't say if it gets into the combat zone. It's failed. Well, I'm going to have to double check that in the rules as well before for the next episode. All right. Oh my goodness. This guy's going to give us a strike. River can't even uh, attack him. So because we have the end of episode card uh, here, this, this is just going to push everything along. And these are not going to be added anymore. These are very slippery cards too. All right. Well, we did get rid of the survivor. Oh boy. All right. Let's see what River's got in her hand. She can't attack this guy. That is really not very good. So she's got her talent. So she's going to play her talent. And she's going to grab a card. And so she ends up with a total of 2, 3, 4 attack. <clears throat> 4 attack and 2, 3, 4 recruit. Choose another player to gain a talent. She can burn her talent to give Jane a talent. I wonder if that's worth it because Jane gets the bonus attack with his talent. But we do want to heal a ship strike when the Kaylee card comes up too. So, ah, decisions, decisions. Well, she has four recruit. Let's take a look at that first. Let's go ahead and give her this card. Uh, if you defeat an enemy this turn, avoid the next strike. So for four recruit, she's going to get the Zoe Warrior card. Um, and the very sad and unfortunate thing is she does have four attack. But she can't take Harkin out because River and Simon can't fight Harkin. Wow, that sucks. All right, I think then with, so we have to decide with four uh, attack, do we want to un <laughs> reveal anything? I mean, if we reveal another soldier, she can take the soldier out. So maybe that's not a bad idea. Let's go ahead and do this for two. That leaves her two attack. Oh my god. Enemy ship. Ah, uh, this can't be defeated if there's a hidden card next to it. <laughs> oh boy. All right, well, that, it is what it is. Uh, wow, we're in real, real trouble. All right, that's the end of... That's basically the end of River's turn. Does she, I don't think she's going to give Jane a talent, extra talent. It's not really worth it. We want to heal ship strikes. Oh my goodness. And she didn't have five recruit to try and uh, get rid of the booby trap either. All right, so she's going to take one strike for... Harkin. Oh man. So River takes another strike. Let's hope it's not catastrophic. No damage. Discard this card. Yes. That's at least a wee bit of luck. That's going to be the end of the episode. So we're going to discard her cards. She's going to drop six new ones. Two, three, four, five, six. This is, this is bad. <laughs> it's not going very well. Um, she's got a talent. Damn it. She didn't get the Kaylee card. And three. Wow. All right, that's going to be the end of our episode. Uh, like I said, I'm going to double check the rules on side jobs. They are in the combat zone. I can't remember. I think they might be failed if they get to the combat zone. But this doesn't say if it reaches the combat zone, it's failed. Uh, so there you go. Anyway, thanks so much for watching along. Thanks for your comments, subscriptions, likes. This is Legendary Encounters Firefly, sort of game two of the campaign, encompassing three episodes, Bushwhacked, Shindig, and Safe. And we're still on the first one. We got rid of the Survivor, though. We've got to get rid of this booby trap. Uh, not good. Not good at all. All right, thanks so much, and we'll see you in the next episode. Alrighty, here we are with a correction at the end of the episode. And it's a good one, actually. So side jobs do go away at the end of the turn if they are in the combat zone. However, Jane, we got two credits for taking out the Survivor. So we're going to spend one credit to heal, and you get a credit and gain a talent. So basically, Jane could have healed this guy, uh, which is going to give us one credit. So we spent a credit to heal, we're going to get a credit. So basically at a net, one for one. And Jane's going to grab a talent for that. So that's pretty cool. So that will not be in here. Uh, and this will then go away. So at the end, we're going to still have two credits. Plus, if we can uh, defuse the bomb, we get three more, I think it is. Otherwise, just one. So anyway, thanks so much. Uh, that was a little correction there, which was beneficial for us, I'm hard to believe. So thanks so much, and we'll see you next time.